So, ladies and gentlemen, please give a very warm welcome for our first speaker, Alan. On the 21st of September 2012, I was diagnosed with acute myeloid leukemia, which is a form of blood cancer. I was devastated. The doctor said they wanted to admit me in the hospital that very same day because my white blood cell count was 500% above the norm. I was a walking time bomb. I was a walking time bomb. You see, I had some things that I need to do, so I asked the doctors if they could give me some medication to control my white blood cell count because I had some people to talk to and some commitments to keep. Because you see, earlier that week, we was in the process of taking our son and doing test driving for cars. Additionally, when I joined the John Maxwell team in July of 2012, I was so excited that I started six mastermind groups in August prior to attending certification training. So what was my family to do? And what about those six mastermind groups? What would you do? Well, I decided I was not going to quit. I prayed. I had faith. I believed that everything was going to be all right, and I took action. So over the course of the next few days, we bought our son a car. We had an extended family meeting to inform them of, of the cancer. And I contacted all 55 participants of those six mastermind groups. I informed them of my health situation. And they immediately said that we can cancel all the training and pick it back up once I got done with my cancer treatment. Well, understanding the law of Big Mo, I thanked them for their concern. And I asked them if I can convert the mastermind groups from a teleconference, from a face-to-face -to, -face to a teleconference format. And they all agreed. So on the 26th of September, just five days later, I was admitted to the hospital. And throughout my 30-day stay, I facilitated six mastermind groups from my hospital room while going through chemotherapy. I even created a, 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 a workstation that included a desk, a laptop, a bookcase, and a, and, a, and a phone. I even created a sign and posted it on my door that says, teleconference in progress. <laughs> Please do not disturb. Well, each of us are going to face a giant that has some obstacle we have to overcome in our life. And it's when, that, in that, in that, in that, when you make that decision, it's in that defining moment that you will either be held back or propelled forward. I decided that I was not going to quit. And I continue to serve my family and my clients. And I just want to encourage you to keep on holding on to your dreams and your goals because a quitter never wins and a winner never quits. And today I am cancer free. Great job. Well done. Well done. Good job.